is Grace. Today I will read the Bible story. Today Bella will read the Bible story together. Hello, my name is Bella. <coughs> I will read the Bible story today. Wow, you can read English, Bella? Yes, I like English. Then you can read. For them. Okay. Tell the people about Jesus. Jesus said to the disciple, When the man meet them in Galilee, go to the world, tell the whole world about I have done for you. After saying this, Jesus went off to the heaven. The disciple watched him for a long time. Angel said to the disciple, Jesus will come back the same way you saw him go. Reuben wanted Jesus stayed and Preach the word good, the good news. The disciples got to know that Jesus was the Son of God. <clears throat> Jesus died on the cross. I want to read now. Okay, you can read. Jesus was risen and went to heaven. He promised to come back. Only the Son of God could do it. The disciple knew that only Jesus could take them to God. The disciple the disciples were there. They went here and there. They told people about Jesus. The people who killed Jesus tried it to kill them too. I don't know. Oh, she is sleeping. 
que a Ubi também vai ser. The disciple told about Jesus. Jesus bravely. People wanted to hear about Jesus more. They wanted to know the way to God. Some people didn't like the disciple. They tried it to put <clears throat> them in jail, but the disciple were happy because many people began to love Jesus. They told people more about Jesus. Priscilla and an Ethiopian live in this village, said an angel to Priscilla, go to a place where I tell you. Pesciolini went to the place the angel told him about. It was no with the way to Jerusalem. It was a wide field. There is no one here. How can I preach God's message? said Pesciolini. Then Pelisha saw a man coming. He was an Egyptian. He was a highest high of the call. He was writing the words of God. Reading the words of God. Do you not? Do you understand 
what you're reading? Asked Pelisha. No, I need help. Can you help me? Said Egypta. I will help you. God sent me here for you, said Pelisha. Pelisha told him to good the good news about God and Jesus. I went to live as Jesus said, said the Egyptian office to Pashilip. Pashilip was excited. <coughs> he understood why God sent him here. The Ofsi went to his country and told his people about Jesus. Jesus is brighter than the sun. Saul hated Jesus. He hated the disciple of Jesus. He hated the people who loved Jesus. Saul thought Jesus was not a, the God's son, son of God. Saul thought Jesus was dead. Why do people have to follow the dead? Saul tried very hard to put the disciple in jail. One day, Saul was going to them If I put them in jail, they won't follow Jesus anymore, said Saul. Something wonderful happened. When he was near the summer, suddenly a bright light flashed of around him. It was brighter than the sun. Saul fell to the ground. Where are why are you a greeted me, Saul? Say someone to Saul. The sound was coming from heaven. Who are you? asked Saul. Saul was scared. He never heard a sound from heaven before. I am Jesus, one the one of you hate follow me, said the sound. Saul could know that Jesus was a leaf. Saul could also know that he was the Son of God in the heaven. He made up his mind to follow Jesus for the rest of his life. Paul and Silo sang in prison. <coughs> I will reach for you. <coughs> Paul and Silas tra traveled around the world and preached the good news. They told people that Jesus was the Son of God. They helped them to love God. Jesus. Some people didn't like like what Saul, Paul, and Sailor was doing. They hated Jesus. They hated the disciple. Put Paul and Saul in prison, shouted the people. They tried it to make us believe Jesus. They are making our city in
they're making our city into an opera. They beat them and put them in prison. They, the Powell thought that Powell and Sil could then talk about Jesus in jail, but they, but that night Powell and Sale sang as and prayed in jail. Other people in jail were listening to their praise and song. Suddenly, the prison was shaking. All the doors of the prison were broken and opened. The jail was afraid. He was afraid that Paul and Sale run away. He was so scared that he tried it to kill himself. Don't kill yourself. We're here, shouted Paul and the jail noticed that Paul and Sale were God's men. He noted that God protect Paul and Sale. I want you to know about your God, said. What should I do, said the jailer. Paul and Sale told the jailer <coughs> and his family about Jesus. They decided to believe him in Jesus and love him. The jailer worshipped the word Paul and Sail. They ate together. The jailer and his family was very happy to believe in God. Yesterday I read that story. It was fun. Then bye.